words. I believe that God will bless you because of his word. He is the one that would come to be the son of God to die for the sins of the world. He is the one that would be qualified. His life would be sinless. And there he is as the Lamb of God hanging on the cross, dying for your sins and mine. The fact that Jesus rose from the dead on the third day is proof that you and I can have new life in him. His resurrection has made it possible for me to serve him the rest of my days. So I encourage you today, if you have not repented from your sins, I encourage you to tell God that you are sorry for every bad thing you've ever done. If you believe that Jesus was buried in the grave, then you would see that baptism is necessary for salvation. If you believe that Jesus rose from the dead, then you would receive the Holy Spirit of God into your heart. You will begin to speak in other tongues under the power of God. Baptism, repentance, and receiving the Holy Ghost are how we observe the death, burial, and resurrection of Jesus Christ. If you are ready to repent of your sins, I want you just to tell God I am sorry for not measuring up to your word. Whatever you need, brothers and sisters, it's in the name of Jesus because he is the one that died for your sins. And when you are ready to be baptized, I encourage you to be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. When you ask God to fill you with his spirit, he will. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah.